So in this video, we are going to learn how to print Fibonacci series without using recursion in Java. So here you can see this is a Fibonacci series 0 1. So 0 plus 1 equal to 1, 1 plus 1 equal to 2 and 1 plus 2 equal to 3 and so on. So let's try to understand how does this code work. So first thing that we need is I need to define two starting point that is 0 and 1 because the sum of two number gives me the third number without that I can't create the Fibonacci series. So let's create our first starting point. So let's say int number 1 that means n1 that is 0 int n2 it means number 2 it is 1 okay after that I will create a new variable called temp okay that means temporary now what I will do I will first print out these two numbers n1 and n2 n1 plus n2 after that I will create a file loop for loop sorry it start from 1 and you will enter uh, how much Fibonacci number you want to see let's say I want to see 20 numbers I press press. damp equal to n1 plus n2 n1 equal to n2 and n2 equal to damp after that copy this paste it and type damp and plus if i save this and run you can see i got this series now let's try to understand how does this code work i mean this is what uh, we are here for so if you look at it what i have done is i have first defined n1 equal to 0 and n2 equal to 1 after that i have created a variable called temp its value is currently undefined okay now first thing that i have done is i have printed 0 and 1 okay now after that i have used my for loop now what i have done is i have called temp and saying hey temp value is the sum of n1 and n2 so 0 plus 1 equal to 1 okay and n1 will equal to n2 it means 1 and n2 will equal to temp so this means once so after that i said hey print the temp so temp print value is 1 so i will write 1 here okay now what i will do as i know that now n1 and n2 is 1 1 so when this loop runs so 1 plus 1 what is it is 2 and this n1's new value is uh, it is 1 and n2 will be 2 okay now similarly when the loop runs again this will be 1 plus 2 sorry So this will be 1 plus 2 and you will get output of 3. Okay. And this loop will go so on. Okay. So 0 plus 1 equal to 1. 1 plus 1 will equal to 2. And 1 plus 2 equal to 3. 3 plus 2 equal to 5. And you, you know this loop will carry on. Uh, how much time 20th time and we'll get 20 number of results so this is how you can print Fibonacci series okay without using recursion in java if you want the code check out the link in description i hope you learned something from this video if you have any kind of doubts and queries feel free to ask thanks for watching and have a great day